Does anyone know where Jehu's at? It's kind of hot out here. I think we should kind of leave. Right here. Ah! You're late. Happy Wednesday, Tigers. It's me, Jehu. And it's me, Elias. Today we have information on ceramics Club, Sense and Sensibility, and more. Now here's the news announcements you, you need, need to, to know. know. Are you sick of school yet? Slow high school expressions will you about your seniorities. Please fill out this quick survey by scanning the QR code on the screen. All seniors are encouraged to fill out fill it out. Please uh, contact reporter Brael Marchado at Brael Marchado at student.slcusd.org with any questions. Thank you. Hey Tigers, just as a reminder, Chess Club is every Thursday at lunch in room 901. <laughs> The ceramics club will let you let to let you know that they will be selling handmade bowls at farmers market tomorrow, May 18th. They donate all of the profits to the local local homeless shelter, and they would really appreciate it if you would come by and see all their great bowls that they have made this year. Cash and credit payments are also accepted. See you there. Time to return school resources to the library. If you have books or technology checked out that you're ready to return, especially if they're from previous trimesters, come by the library starting this week. The library's official return schedule starts Thursday, June 1st for seniors. And seniors, remember all of your resources must be turned in prior to graduation. Check out our flyers around campus for more info. We are happy to assist you with questions about what you have checked out or how to return the items. Seniors, recognition assembly is Tuesday, May 23rd. This is the best assembly of the year. Plan now to wear your college or university attire. Order your t-shirt today. We will be honoring senior students and staff for many achievements. Don't forget to put your name on the Career Center wall. Seniors at Slow High this year have pushed through four years of high school and are near their graduation, which is why this upcoming Senior Recognition Assembly on May 23rd, this upcoming Tuesday, honors them. Um, my name is Brinley Ewan and I am Spirit Commissioner. Brinley is in charge of all gatherings such as spirit rallies and other gatherings. So we wanted her input on how she feels about the assembly. Um, I think it's important because this is our last final moment in our high school career and I think this is a time for us to acknowledge one another and show respect and attention to everyone that deserves it. The assembly will be right over here in the big gym. One caveat to this is that the seniors will not be in the bleachers. Instead, they will be in a set of white chairs in the middle of the gym while the juniors, sophomores, freshmen, and upcoming eighth graders will come to Slow High next year. This is one of the best opportunities for them to really get a glimpse of what high school students are like and the foreshadowing of graduating as a senior. I do think it'll be a good experience, especially for the eighth graders, because I think it gives them, one, a look at who their sophomores, juniors, and seniors will also be, and I think it'll be just like a good experience for them. This will be the last gathering event of the year, but especially one of the last times we get to recognize our seniors and how much they've pushed themselves and succeeded throughout the best they could have at Slow Chess. My stuff room, doing out. Attention all seniors, the senior survey is now live in your class of 2023 Google Classroom, so please fill it out now. Celebrate Kindness Month with the Reach Save Club by making a kindness card for a teacher or friend, enjoying a lunch activity or creating chalk art. Um, the month of May is Kindness Month. Tiger, show your people how grateful you are and some extra kindness. The final Slowages Theater production is happening in less than a week. Get your tickets for Sense and Sensibility now at slowagesdrama.ludus.com to support the student, cast, crew, and director. Now to a sports anchor, Duncan, with the Tiger Sports. Uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, sports. Varsity Baseball has a CIF playoff game today against Redwood High in Visalia. As our Tiger Varsity Baseball season comes to a close, we asked some of our retiring seniors how they enjoyed it and what some of their favorite moments were. Uh, the season of baseball was great. Uh, we've had a lot of fun. We're still going right now. Yeah. It's been a lot of fun bonding with my teammates. It's people that I love. Um, it was a great season, super fun. Got to bond with my guys, you know, made a lot of good memories. Uh, my favorite moment of the season was definitely one day after practice and we went all as a team went to the beach at like nine o'clock and played spike ball in the dark. We uh, kind of kicked out of the bush and tossed him in the ocean. That was a highlight, it was pretty fun. How to be uh, going to James Machado's house and watching South Park with the team? Uh, my favorite moment of the season is definitely going over to Chance's house, you know, hanging out, having fun on a Friday, you know, like, 
just hanging out with the guys, especially HI3, that's my guy, you know, I love that guy, so, uh, you know, we're just, just dudes being dudes, you know what I mean? The Tigers did very good in league, and overall. Here's some input from the players on whether they are satisfied with their season results. I am definitely satisfied with our points. We're basically like 17-3, somewhere there. Of course, 16-2, it's always a great thing. 17-3 is, you know, a great record. You know, couldn't, couldn't ask for a whole lot more from the guys. We asked some of them what they have planned for the future and whether this future involves baseball. Uh, next year, after I graduate, I will be attending Cal Poly Slow, be majoring in biological sciences. And uh, yeah, I'll see, you'll see me in the men's league next year. It's gonna be awesome. I plan on attending Pepperdine University. And I'm gonna be hooping at the University of Oregon. Uh, play hard, Tigers. Uh, now back to Elias and Jehu with lunch in U.S. history. For lunch today, we'll be having a chicken fajita burrito, a bean and cheese burrito, and oh my gosh, no way, you wouldn't believe it, we are having the local cheese box with Cal Poly cheese. On this day in U.S. history, Court is in session. I, Earl Warren, hereby announce that racial segregation among schools is not in fact equal, but rather disadvantages the education of African American children. It is decided that all races shall be integrated within the same schools, thus overturning Plessy v. Ferguson. That's all for today, Tigers. We'll, we'll see, see you on the flip side.